Oh my god, it's a... It's, it's even got a lid. That's ridiculous. Or redunculous. around and see just what kind of ruin this is. <laughs> I didn't think that would work. To hell? Just gonna run around in the lake for a while? Okay. Oh, get back here, you giant chicken. It's probably a chicken dinner under that lid. Dude! Why are you picking on Bunger? Kind of a big jerk, are you, Bonger? Get back here, you coward. You overgrown TV dinner? Although that container says more leftovers than TV dinner. Like, take home. I'll talk to you in a minute. I don't know. Why is it on the ground? Okay, well, it still caught fire anyway, so... See, it said it was blue. Now I just have to wait for it to rot. Or I can recall it. From the menu. There we go. There we go. Go. All right, I'll worry about catching things in a bit, but for right now, I hey, this was a dead end. Okay, what's that? Oh, there's a key. Uh, so where could this open? I don't know, some kind of triangle door, maybe, because that's how these games work. Because somehow it's not stupid at all to put an insignia on a key that matches the door it goes to. Oh, it's a celery stick. Yep. How did you get out here? I hadn't opened the door yet. When you were out here. You had vanished. From That's the spaghetti spider. Is there another one of those statues anywhere? Because there's no way in hell I'm going to be able to carry the, one of those explosive jars this far. It doesn't have a protective layer. Oh, it's a pie. Of course, it, it's even in the name. I don't know. I, I don't know these things. Giant flamey chipoof. I couldn't get a good look at it before. All right, rather than deal with the shrink spice, they should just give me a really, really big trap. There's the cheese ball. I haven't caught any of these things yet, except for Bunger, and that's kind of the tutorial critter. Get this crap out of my way. Clobsteroni. Beloved trampoline? But aren't lobsters food anyway? Let me answer that for you. Yes, yes they are. Huh.
That looks like a lunch pad spot. And I wasn't even standing on it. That is sad. We. Yeah, no, this thing is kind of crap for actually launching any launching me anywhere. Alright. I was kind of hoping there'd be an upgrade available for it at some point, but that doesn't seem to be a thing in this game. Are you vicious? Nope. Okay, so there's got to be clues in the underground chamber. All right, it works for me. We oh, it's a pecan pie. Heck yeah, I'm catching that thing. Irma Gerd, pecan purr. Bugs? No, it's just another one of those chocolates. Ah! I ran right into the fire. All right, or walked right through it, even. Huge fire. All right. I'm almost surprised that's a clue, given that it's just a sized-up bonfire. But hey. Destroyed door. Bummer, man. Alrighty. I found all the clues. Judging by what we've seen, I'd say this was a communal living space. One of the few that wasn't utterly destroyed anyway. Gosh, technology and culture are so much more advanced than what we've seen so far. This city must have been the center of Stone Grumpus society. And at the very center, Interesting the temple, theory, yes. possibly led by a priestess <coughs> of Mother Nature. Why the mazes? Hmm, that's a great question. There's definitely easier ways to lock a door. <laughs> But seeing as this was the height of their craftsmanship, it's possible they built those mazes just to show off. All right, tell me about other nature. I don't know too much, but I'll say it's one of the world's oldest practicing religions. I'm sure Shelda could tell you more about it. But on that subject, it's odd I never saw hide nor hair of Mother Nature back on Snacktooth. It's possible she showed up relatively late in their culture, adding to the existing worship of bug snacks. Or maybe they didn't want reminders of church everywhere they went, so they would come to the temple on weekends and... Should we explore? Oh, I thought you'd never ask. <laughs> never look a gift temple in the gateway, as Grandma used to say. <laughs> I'll meet you by the entrance, yeah? <laughs> well, your grandma was a one-note horse who never, apparently never thought about anything but archaeology in her entire life. That's a damn shame. Her fixation is kind of weird. Alright. Wow, sauce stays on things a long time. But unfortunately, I can't lure that sauce eating thing over here, so. Bunga, 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 bunga. Was that thing here earlier? Okay, so the one I threw it fluky blew up and exploded on impact, but this one I just have to wait and wait and wait and wait. And wait. Get back here, you stupid clobsteroni. Alright. I should probably call it here. This has definitely been too long for a video. 
If you enjoyed, please like, comment, subscribe, or not. Not the boss of you. Good night. All right, we are back. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. I'm Mr. Babble. This is Bug Snacks DLC Island. Hey, buddy. But you've got a check mark over your head. Okay. I destroyed the obstacle. The past once more revealed, and yet no less treacherous. One's heart is filled with dread for the truths yet unknown within the River Shrine. Nevertheless, Talk we normal. must push forward. <laughs> Have faith. Okay. Thanks for that. You know the path to this was clear, like, ages ago. Oh, I'm sorry, did you need to go to a different temple? This one not good enough for you? We're up to shrine, now what? Thanks for meeting me out here. I guess if it's just you and me. <laughs> Thank I you, for the love of God. Oh, the front entrance to this place looks too strenuous for these old bones. But I believe there's a side entrance into the shrine. When you find it, can you please open it for me? Or, you know, just use the side entrance, you know, because... Huh. Alright. I gotta get up on that rock somehow. Nope. Hey, you. Hey, that's a big spoon. That's a big egg. Uh-oh. Oh, that didn't open it. What a cheap trick. Doink. Whoa, Eggler can fly now? Come on, get back here, you jerk. I need to scan you. A devil Eggler. Just as I get the friggin' thing. Oh, that's hard. And of course, it regains its frosties. Hold on, I'll get it. Alright, that wasn't quite long enough for a video, in all honesty, so I'm gonna keep going for a bit. First of all, like that. Alright. Oh. Oh, thanks for nothing, part partially lifted bridge. Boom. Lit it. All right, that was lit, bro. All right, uh, that didn't really seem to do much. Uh, okay, I've got a ramp now. I don't have a bridge. Okay, those things are not some barnacle-related food pun. All right. Hmm. Uh, oh no, it, it did in fact open the door. Okay. 
All right, big guy carrying a trampoline. Why are you over here and not over there? And why are you, I mean, what I mean is why are you turning around without making a complete circuit? That kind of sucks. All right, I'll figure it out. What do you like to eat, buddy? He likes hot sauce and cheese. Okay. All right, buddy. What's happening, buddy? You know, as much as people love to pick on... Well, used to pick on Polly Shore. Now he's pretty much irrelevant. Until he came back with that god-awful Pinocchio. Uh, um... Well, I forgot what I was saying. Oh! Goofy movie. He will always be awesome in the Goofy movie. And there's nothing anybody can do about that. Alright, that was fairly simple. Okay. Okay. Hello. Oh, oh good. There's a way to open this up. There you go, old lady. And now I've got more access to the same powder I had access to before. Shrine is open. This place. It's almost identical to the shrines I used to visit in my youth. But it's been twisted. Corrupted. Here, Mother Natural Ray is the bringer of bug snacks. The stories they passed down. The warnings about the toxin. They must have come from experience. The shrines of your use? Yes, youth? Yes, the place where I learned about the beauty and wisdom of this world. Oh, that's kind of sad. I hear it's a parking lot now. Was this the original temple? No. The mother is a purest light. Her ageless wisdom vastly predates these You yourself are corrupted. So maybe it used to be the original. But her followers are a different story. <laughs> no one starts life off the path. That's why we all need guidance. But you kind of admitted most of that stuff was BS. I grew up hearing stories about the dangers of Snacktooth Island, passed down through the oral tradition from those who survived it. Not that many did survive it. Just enough to give one very clear message. Yeah, well, if what the brought them down was what I suspect, you'd think they would tell it plain and simple. Unless they were as, uh, as... Fraud, fraudy as you and devoted to speaking only in cryptic riddles. Because it will lead to your doom. What doom? I, I do not know. The story's gotten frustratingly vague over time. Oh, I did! Every day at the top of my lungs! I've it's known you for, you what, two days? Listen. It wasn't Why'd you really come a raffle, here? I can tell you that. <sighs> come with me to the crater. There's something else I want to see. All right. What is that? Oh, it's just another clobster thingy. All right. Fine, be that way. All right, I've already caught one of the Clobsters, so I don't really see much point in... I guess I could catch that cheese ball. Problem is, it won't keep still. Get back here, you! You big jerk! I'm chasing you down. I probably should have gone around the other way, come to think of it. There we go. Stupid bunger. And now it's going right back the way it came, because because it's stupid. Alright. This time I'll get it. This time for sure! Oh yeah, Bullwinkle and Rocky references are sure going to go over well with the kids of today. Alright. 13, 12, 11, yeah, yeah, yeah. 7, 6, 4, 3, 2, go!
Why the heck can't this thing just burst on impact? Can I shrink it twice? That one just did shrink but burst on impact. I'm confused. You all saw it. I have video evidence of me throwing one and it just bouncing off of something. Huh. Is it shrunk forever? What the hell? Give that back! Jerk. So you love hot sauce, huh? Hey, get away from me! Jerk. Alright, now you're a burning spider. I'm sure that's really the best for everyone. Alright. Piss off! Um, where did the cheese ball go? You're not the cheese ball. Alright, that does it. Get the hell away from me. How did it break apart? That's what I want to know. Where did the thing that was in the log go? Is this the same log? Where did the cheese ball... Okay, it apparently eventually regains its size! Okay. Bring it on, stupid. How did I miss that? There we go. Come on. Oh, come on. You were covered in hot sauce before. What the hell, man? Okay, you're shrunk. Now I just need you... Thank you. Millie Mochi. Okay, that's one of the things I need to feed What's-His-Face. What am I supposed to feed him? Chedorp, this guy. Okay. Alright, I'll get it. This time I'll put a trap in the way. And then I'll shrink him. Come here, you. Alright. Mega Bunger, get out of my way. Go away. You smell. Huh. Didn't even track onto me. Okay. Where did my trap go? I'm guessing the big stupid thing still left. Okay. The big spider. Oh, and I forgot to swap. Come here, buddy. Cheese ball. Cheddorb. All right. Okay. They get tricksy to catch, but I can do it. Wait, that's the wake up. 
Revelate. No, that did it, did it, did it. Then what the heck was I humming? Oh well. Hey, buddy. I forgot what I'm supposed to do for YouTube, you but I can just check my notes. All right. Um. Millie Mochi. Millie Mochi. I'm getting yum, really yum, sick yum. of looking at your pizza body. It's really creepy. Intriguing. Oh, that's much better. That could you could just be a normal grumpus like that. Millie Mochi. Ow. Mochi oh, horn. Neat. Oh, it was specific instructions. Oh well. Okay, his hand into Ched Orb. Thankfully, he gave me this device, so... Leg into Milimochi. And his... Where is Chedorb? I know I fed it to him. I feel ever so slightly cheated. I'm gonna have to catch another one. Oh no, I didn't. I fed him something else by accident. Okay. Shit or unbelievable. Oh, his hand. Yes, I'm kidding. I actually know what I'm doing. I'm goofing around at this point. There we go. Ah, decently competent work. Unfortunately. Any remnants of the spice seem to have been digested, but this too yields interesting results. In their shrunken state, the bug snacks here are not fundamentally different from those on Snack Tooth proper. Yeah, unless they grow back and you burst. I am still forming my hypotheses, <coughs> but I presume the process is endemic to this island, and the spice was created to inhibit it. Are there any side None effects? None beyond the usual. <laughs> After all, Chandler ate a Bunga Royale as soon as we arrived. And he seems alive and well. You said this would be simple. It will be simple. I am merely exhausting every avenue of study. It's called being thorough. Look it up. Now, I've observed chocolates capable of maintaining a small size. This may present a more stable vessel for the spice. Regrettably, I must not eat it, delicious though it may be. So, bring one to my science trough, please. It's an ant. It'll just crawl out. I got you, you choco ant. <laughs> At last, a viable sample. Now I can extract the powder and finally put this mystery to rest. This requires my utmost concentration, and you ask far too many questions. You may return when I found my answer. <laughs> Whoa! Sorry, the a dented-in soda bottle that was sitting on the floor with the lid on just decided to pop out. 